Hello and welcome to What We Know For Sure. Today's topic is why men never take no for an answer. And I wanted to talk about this in a, in a couple of directions, not just, you know, the usual one um, where we uh, always look at it from a sexual standpoint. It's very important for us to understand that for centuries, men have always been the ones who are revered, the ones who do handle financial matters, uh, legal matters, um, all, all the house, um, housing matters, in other words, they were the ones who had, had their names on, on homes and um, houses were left at them because they were the sons. So they were always taught and brought up to be aggressive. Women were always brought up to be submissive, um, to be the dainty ones at home. And their duty was to, to have kids and to take care of the house. More so with women really wanting to be recognized for their intelligence, aggressiveness, their ability to multitask and to be able to even find their own spouses and um, take the risk there. You know, we don't want to take away the the ability for men to say no, to, to be aggressive in their business stance and, you know, their financial stance and everything else. We, we have to kind of come up and make sure that we don't take no for an answer ourselves. We must never take no for an answer. So if you want something really badly, go for it. Um, that's the only way in business you can succeed. But there's a fine line when it comes to um, the sexual aspect of it. When a woman says no, it means no. The woman decides that she wants to leave you. Um, whether the woman decides she wants to divorce you. She doesn't want to have sex with you, whether she's your wife or your girlfriend. The word no has to be taken seriously because anything that is done when someone says no is a violation and that is considered um, rape or, or harassment, um, stalking. And those are very important things to know. Life is a lot more realistic. You know, there are boundaries that need to be respected and, and, and adhered to, especially now because the world is a very different place. Girls are a hell of a lot more independent. They understand what they want, who they are. They want to make sure that they are working, they are financially uh, free. Their, their independence is critical for any human being, whether it's a man or a woman, and that has to be respected. The only, I feel that mothers need to teach their sons of where you to draw the line. Women have to bring their daughters up as well the same way, with strength, with the ability to know that they know who they are. That is the new world, that is the new age. So on the whole, I think the reason men have never been able to take no for an answer when it comes to sexual activities is because they've always been led to believe that they were always in the right. And that is no more. Well, that's my view on it. And I hope that the world that we are going into post COVID would be a better one. And that we've all had time to really sit down and change the way the world we live in and want it to be better because that's what this is all about and um, you know you spend so much time uh, with yourself as well as you know, with your families that hopefully things that were done in the past will not be done in the future all right well have a wonderful day and remember to smile